What I wish I knew about consumer behavior before my first economics class? First up, classical utility theory. Imagine you're a 19th century shopper. Every purchase is about getting the biggest bang for your buck. Shout out to Jevons, Menga and Walrus for that one. Moving on to marginal utility analysis by Marshall in 1890. Think of this as your extra slice of pizza. Each bite gives you less satisfaction until you hit the I can't eat another bite wall. In 1938, Samuelson brought us revealed preference theory. It's like Instagram for economists. Your choices reveal your preferences, no filters needed. Then there's indifference curve theory by Hicks and Allen in 1934. Picture this, you're equally happy with coffee or tea, just on different curves of satisfaction. The Neumann Morgenstern approach of 1944. It's all about rolling the dice with risk and reward. Lastly, the Friedman Savage hypothesis from 1948. It shows how we're all thrill seekers and safety lovers at the same time, and that's consumer behavior simplified. Happy studying, econ wizards.